Well, tonight, a new push to ban assault weapons in the wake of the Pulse attack. A local group is getting ready to make its voice heard. Eric Sandoval is live outside Pulse tonight for us. Eric? Yeah, Matt, this group is called Ban Them, and the founder tells me he doesn't want what happened here at Pulse happening again. And we found out his group isn't alone in demanding change. In the three weeks since 49 lives were lost at the Pulse nightclub, we've watched several groups come out fighting, demanding some kind of gun reform. We will occupy this floor. We will no longer be denied a right to vote. Two weeks ago tonight, we watched Democrats on the U.S. House floor stage a sit-in, demanding a vote. Florida Congressman Alan Grayson introduced this bill, seeking to reinstate the ban on assault-style weapons. But we've also watched the pushback. Governor Rick Scott refusing to call a special session on a gun vote. And the National Rifle Association telling News 6 tonight none of the legislation that these anti-gun advocates support would have stopped the terrorist attack in Orlando or any of the recent terrorist attacks or mass shootings. To take a harsh stance against a big, tough opponent like the NRA, you cannot negotiate. They do not negotiate. Carlos Navarro started the group Ban Them the week after the Pulse nightclub massacre. He says he supports the Second Amendment and the right to bear arms, but he wants all assault-style weapons banned. He's taking his message to the steps of Orlando City Hall at a rally on Thursday. He's going to be calling on his supporters to call their congressman. Well, the main goal of the rally was to show a united front, to show the world that Orlando is not going to let this slip by like the others. This is where we stop and we say enough is enough and we're going to start change here in Orlando and then grow. Now, the NRA tells me that banning these guns is not the solution here. They say politicians need to focus instead on the root of what is causing these shootings. We put the information on tomorrow night's rally on our website, clickorlando.com. We have also put a link to the NRA's discussion on the ban on assault-style weapons. We're live at the Pulse nightclub tonight. Eric Sandoval, News 6. Matt. Uh, Eric, thank you very much.